lot of our clients ask us, you know, if my dog has a way and they're in pain, uh, should I try to get them moving or should I just, you know, minimize movement? Uh, I feel like most people on this call probably know, but we always say, you know, definitely want to make them move more frequently, uh, but actually not too long either. So frequency over length is important, but you definitely like if your dog is struggling, you want to try as much as possible to get them to move, right? Because otherwise, if they stop moving, it just makes their joints even stiffer. And that kind of just doesn't help. So there's lots of studies that show that if you are not moving, your fascia actually stiffens and your fascia it literally controls about 40% of the contraction of the muscle. So you want to be stretching. So doing your doggy yoga uh, and for humans, doing your stretching is super important for so many things. So blood vessels, arteries taking from the heart to the body have muscle that push the blood along, but veins coming from the body back to the heart do not. So the only way that flows is because you're moving your muscles and that helps push that blood along so that we have better circulation and it takes healthy blood to help heal things.